you go. Welcome to Sunday. Good morning. How are you? You alright? Um, I hope you've had a good weekend so far. It's not over yet. Um, I don't know if you're going to have a shave yourself today, but... Uh, right, what am I having? What are we having? What are we having? It's not like dinner. Not yet. I purchased this on eBay. No, not an empty box. A Colmac. Colmac shaving set and it comprises of cream, a razor and a brush. Cream, razor, made in Britain and a brush. Heavy, a bit like the Wilkinson Soul Classic, the metal in the handle, but it's a, one of these double-edged, um, or twin blade I should say, cartridge type. Um, I'm not using this. I would use it if it had a spare head, but because it's um, never been used, I don't want to use it, if that makes sense, because I don't know if I can re replace the head. So I'm going to keep that one side as part of the set, if you understand me. But we are going to use um, the cream and this, the Colmac uh, brush, and it's a ball brush. Um, and what I've done with this is I've previously lathered it with an antibacterial soap and rinsed it, then re-lathered it again, and then rinsed it. Um, and it's just been soaking now, so that's ready to go in a minute. Um, give this a shake. The razor of choice is going to be the Eco, this one here, the SE, the Eco Black, Razor Rock Eco Black SE single edge blade. And inside has got, um, let me just put this cream in the bowl. Let's see what it looks like. Smells nice. Very liquidy. Reminds me a bit of the, I'll show you now. Reminds me a bit of the, uh, in the bottom there, of the Ingram. That does that, liquidizes, and people think, oh, it's gone off or something, so we'll see. It should be, should be okay. But the Ingram is known for that, the menthol shave cream. Yeah, so the, I'll show you this, is a three-piece non-adjustable single-edged razor. And if I can carefully take that off, inside there is half a Persona Med Prep blade. And it is two on the die, so it's been used twice. Third use for that. Twice on the dice. So that's nice. And there's the exposure there. What I remember of this razor is quite a like a well aggressive maybe I think if I remember rightly so we'll get this just rinse the face wet it not long come out the shower actually so it's not too bad and here we go let's see how it goes very stiff not So far, so good. Colmac, made in Britain. This, um, I'm not sure the when it was made. I, ex I expect somewhere around the probably late seventies, early eighties, something like that, maybe or the eighties. Um, well, it seems to be. Yeah, smells a standard cream. There's no sort of major scent to it. So we'll see how we get on with that. Here we go. Yeah, brushes have come on a long way since this. It's, it's, it's okay. It'd be good or not for hard soaps. But it's not been used, I suppose, so it needs to, like any other ball brush, it needs to be sort of run in. So it's a very stiff knot. And again, considering the age of this cream, 
there's no effect on my skin smells basic standard lathers lovely so so far so good Colmax shave set right that'll go we'll heat the razor rock eco black yes yeah, so how's the weekend going I hope you're having a good one right here we go first pass persona med prep third use half a blade good audio feedback these blades are good there's one of the Colmac hairs by the looks of it and thanks again for telling me of your shave of the days in the comments I, I love looking at that when I'm um, generally when I'm preparing dinner and cooking and stuff and I go back and have a read somebody's left another comment shave of the day and it's nice to see what you good folks are using Yeah, quite an aggressive um, razor, but in a, in a nice way. Especially with this uh, blade in it. Really nice. So that was a successful first pass. Uh, again, a few questions when I've used a, an old cream like this. Um, aren't you afraid of using out of date soaps or creams? Um, no, I'm not afraid because if I'm not sure if it smells off or whatever, I wouldn't use it. That there was liquefied, it's old. Doesn't mean it's off or it's bad, so I lather it up. Um, and it's it's okay it's, and the slickness is really nice really good slickness basic scent but it does the job you know so and that's what it looks like lathered up so no i'm not afraid um of using old so i mean um, old spice i mean over 40 50 odd years old <laughs> and it's better than some of the new stuff so no i i get quite excited using old stuff um, but you've got to be careful. I know what you mean. You have got to be careful. But common sense. Common sense prevails. Even I got common sense sometimes. Not always. I quite like this brush knot. It's you don't hear of this. Uh, I've heard of Colmac, obviously. But um, you don't hear many shaves with it. Very small knot and brush. Um, I would like to guess what size that knot is. But the looks of it is something like an 18 millimeter. <laughs> okay, doesn't say in the box. This is all you need for a smooth, clean shave. So very nice. So far, so good. Second pass. Eco black razor rock. Here we go. Across the growth now. Oh, no overhang. So that's an SE razor with no overhang. Let's 
so what's your shave of the day then? Mrs H ran 10 miles yesterday the chip he was closing <laughs> no ran 10 miles hats off to her she's worked really hard over the years running she enjoys it she's done many half marathons um, I think she's got another one this year uh, coming up so um very proud of her. This is nice. If you're working this weekend, many thanks and I hope the weekend goes well for you. And what's the rest of us doing? Well, uh, we're chilling here. Um, are you home? Are you staying home today? Are you got a day out planned? Family? If you've got family, it's a, usually a family weekend, isn't it? I know a lot of parents, while well, they're doing this country, I don't know what it's like in other countries. But, they're like a taxi service for their children, there's football or there's, uh, you know, whatever sport they're doing or they're <laughs> doing all sorts of stuff and running here back and to and so it's not really a weekend off for the parents. So I suppose if you're one of those and you, you really enjoy your 10, 20, 30 minutes of shave time, hopefully. Yeah. That was just right, just, just right amount of, I can't speak. Just the right amount of cream there. Right, what I'm going to do is just add a touch of water. See what happens. Mm -hmm. Seem to remember seeing these sort of packs and sets for sale in Boots the Chemist, if I'm not mistaken, years ago. I didn't think twice of buying them and if I could go back now I'd have bought the lot and Old Spice had have stocked up you'd have made a fortune wouldn't you? <laughs> yeah. There we go okay really enjoying this third against the growth now huh? So for dinner today, I'm roasting a pheasant, which I had um, I had a brace as a gift at Christmas. I've had one, and. Uh, I put the other in the freezer, so I'm going to have that today. Roast that with roast potatoes, Welsh potatoes. I'm doing some broccoli, cauliflower, lashentos of gravy. Listen to that. Oh, I caught myself in the corner. I think. As I say, it's an aggressive razor, but in a nice way, very tight 
um, very efficient and very smooth doing it. You can certainly hear it. Yeah, I thought I did. Just the corner of the blade just stopped and it dug in. My fault, dawdling. Don't forget to check the um, video description for a um, Facebook group, my other channel, uh, there's Instagram, Twitter, um, what else is on there? There's a few things on there and there's usually a list of links to things, if I can put them in. Well, I can't put a link to the shaving set today, but there yeah, look at Because um, a few people ask where I can get this, that and the other, so I usually put some links in the video description. If you fancy having a look, very slick soap. Wow. So, three, two, one, pick up time, baby. I know the camera's level, baby. Whoever said that it made me laugh. That somebody said they were watching on a. Oh, I can't stand the thought of it. Don't tell me watching on a huge screen in the. Because somebody sent a photo on Mrs. H come running to me with it to show me a picture. They were. My face was on that huge TV in the States somewhere. God, I can't, it goes through me enough to see myself like that. Don't mind on a small screen. I don't know why, but um, anyway, I hope it's level today on your big screen. That's scary, isn't it? Here we go. Really nice. And Wednesday I'll be using a, I've been sent another razor by Sheldon Global Shave Club. Now I know one or two people are um, not keen on the idea of all these uh, razors being sent by a, a same company, but um, you know, each to their own. They're kind enough to send them. Um, it's nice to see somebody making stuff. He's trying to do a business. Um, so, you know, he sent it, so I'm going to use it, but just to forewarn those that are not keen on the, um, well, me using that type of stuff, but uh, it's a shave, isn't it? And as I say, they've been, mind you, I do joke, I call him the, the next Gillette, he's... <laughs> Wow. Touch that.
Beautiful. Cold water rinse. And then we're going to hit. Now it's cold. Ice cold. That wake up. Another lot of miniature daffodils. I know that much in roses. Another thing. Green leafy leaf. <laughs> things. Right, what are we going to use? I'll show you that. I'm going to use this um, mentholated um, witch hazel which I made up in this posh bottle. That bottle's been in here. Oh, that's nice. What a difference. Um, ornamental, really. Uh, there's another one here. Never use them. Should do, really. Nice bird on that. <laughs> I'll use it for something. But uh, Mrs H put them in the uh, sort of decorative uh, pieces, but I thought I'd use it, this. Nice, eh? So that's the mentholated witch hazel, just standard witch hazel, with some uh, crystal, uh, mentholated crystal from um, PAA, their uh, grind, what do you call it? The grinder. And it's really nice, like a salt mill. Chill mill, that's what it's called, chill mill. And then I'm going to go some Floyd the Genuine, lovely classic scent. This has got a hit of menthol in it. Not a lot though, I don't think. Oh, that's lovely. <laughs> hey, classic Floyd. Talking of Floyd, not spelled the same way, F-L-O-Y-D, a chef, he's passed away now. He was the first time he used to go all around the world. Keith Floyd loved a drink and uh, didn't care the hell, just cooked stuff, chucked it in. <laughs> he's a very clever man and I, I like watching his programmes. You can still see a few of them on YouTube where he goes abroad and tries different things because I love anything cooking. Anyway, wrong subject. And then we're going to put this L'Oreal Hydrosensitive Soothing Birch Sap Post Shave Balm, zero colorants and zero alcohol. Good stuff. That's a lovely scent. That. And then I'll let you get on with your day. Yeah, so just to forewarn anybody that thinks uh, using too many of the old GS. See razors. That'll be the next one. That's lovely. Okay, so what have we used? We've used the Razor Rock Eco Black, the SE three piece non adjustable, no overhang. And inside, I used a third use half a blade of the Persona Med Prep. Really nice, aggressive, but very efficient and feels very nice. We've used the Colmac shaving set, except for this, uh, do you mind, thank you, except for this razor, because I can't get a new head for it maybe. So I'm gonna keep that as a set, because this will go back in as a set now, I've used it. The Colmac bore brush, um, very stiff knot, very small, but work really nicely. Um, what else, we use the Colmac uh, sh lava shaving cream, basic scent, it has liquefied a bit, even though you shake it, that's due to age, but it worked beautifully, slick, very comfortable, look at that. I did have a bit of a, I caught myself there, dug in, but it's okay. Clean and smooth. Then we rinsed off with cold water. We've used mentholated witch hazel I made myself. Um, Floyd. The genuine aftershave, gorgeous stuff. My own bowl, and then L'Oreal Men Expert Hydra Sensitive Post Shave Balm with a birch sap. And that's me done. Ready to hit the road, hit the kitchen anyway to do some cooking. <laughs> so whatever you do this weekend, I hope you have a great one. Have some fantastic shaves. If you go out, stay safe. Um, and I'll see you on Wednesday for this midweek shave. Many thanks and take care.